and mums and dads and welcome to story time and have some confetti. We're very, very excited here today and I've got Maxwell as, uh, here as well because today we are celebrating story time uh, birthday for the very first time. It's one year old today. So we're all very, very excited, aren't we Maxwell? We've got lollipops and a cake and it's just been marvellous. What a wonderful year we have had. Now, Maxwell, before we get into anything else, we have some very important thank yous that we have to uh, get underway first. So, I would like to say thank you to all the mums and the dads and, of course, the dear poppets and all the other grown-ups that tune in for story time. Um, it's very, very much appreciated and we try very hard here to keep a story time interesting um, for all those little poppets out there and to keep an eager interest in books and learning to read and we try very hard to achieve that through imagination and play so we really do thank you for your support so thank you so much and of course Stinky who else do we need to thank? That's right we need to thank YouTube so thumbs up for YouTube thank you so much YouTube because Without YouTube and the internet, of course, this just would not be possible. And we are able to uh, make these videos and little poppets all around the globe are able to tune in for story time. So thank you so much to YouTube. Yay! Thumbs up for YouTube. So, as you can see, and I've got a bit of a frog in my throat, so you'll have to mind my throat. I've caught a cold, unfortunately. I just got rid of that ladybird-itis and now I have a cold. Well, as you can see, we're in a very festive mood. So like most ladies, I've been shopping. I've got a marvellous flamingo here, and we've got balloons, and oh, I've, I couldn't help myself, my little poppets, when I was at Toy World, which I have to say is one of my favourite places in the whole world, isn't it, Maxwell? Um, I do love Toy World. You got ladybird-itis. I did have that, but I'm all better, and now I have a cold, unfortunately. But I was just saying to the poppets, Maxwell, when I was at Toy World, I got a La La a loopsy doll which I like very very much and I just love those dolls so I got one of those and this lovely flamingo here and some other bits and pieces and also oh I just couldn't help myself look at this I got this marvelous my little pony I couldn't resist her either simply marvelous I love ponies so presents and cake and balloons simply wonderful now I suppose before we start the book for today we should sing happy birthday and we're going to light the candle on the cake that little candle at the front there so stinky um, I might get Maxwell to hold you dear because I don't know I, I said I'll do it no you're too little to handle a lighter you can't handle it you're a big boy yes I know you're a big boy but you're still too little for a lighter you can't use that all matches all right then yes you must be on your best behavior it's a special day now Maxwell you look after Stinky dear, <coughs> oh, frog in my throat, and I'll light this candle and then hopefully my magic uh, banana phone will be working so we can sing happy birthday. Now I'll just switch the dial so it sounds a little bit nicer when I sing. Yes, that's on. So we'll give it a test. Testing! One, two, three, testing! Oh, no, let me adjust it again. Ah, oh, that seems better. And here we go, my little poppets. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to story time. Happy birthday to story time. Happy birthday to you. Oh, and the magic's worn off just in time. Hip hip hooray, hip hip hooray for story time. And blow it out, Maxwell. <laughs> Oh, and some claps are in order, I think. Yes, for story time. Wonderful. Well, Maxwell, I think we should definitely crack on because what am I doing? I'm waffling on just a bit. And Stinky, no, that's very hot, dear. It's got hot wax. So you look after Stinky. You're going to listen to the story, dear. Excellent. So we should crack on with the story. And, oh, Stinky, you're a bit of a rascal, I think. Today's story is called My Little Poppets. Aunt Amelia and there it is there and it does look like a good one and I have to say I have read this one before and it is a favorite of mine I do like it very much now stinky 
I know you're very excited and you've already had lots of sweets and lollipops and things, but I need you to be a good mouse and to sit there with Maxwell so I can read the story to the poppets. All right, Maxwell, and you're going to be a good boy, aren't you? Because you, you're always a good boy. All right, Stinky, so I need you to behave. <clears throat> right, and here we go, my little poppets. We were in a bad mood. Aunt Amelia was coming to look after us. We didn't know who Aunt Amelia was and we didn't want looking after. Well, there's the poppets there and they're in a bad mood apparently. They don't want to have Aunt Amelia around. Stinky, I want you to stop that dear and I want you to sit down. You have to pop him down there dear because he gets a bit naughty. He's had too many sweets, I think. Dad said we had met her once before when we were tiny. Mum said we had to be good. Well, there's Aunt Amelia there, and I have to say, I do like her hat. It does look rather marvellous. What a wonderful hat. Can you see Aunt Amelia, Maxwell? She does look marvellous in that hat. What a wonderful hat it is. Mum and Dad left a list of instructions. Thank you, said Aunt Amelia. I'm sure these will be very useful. We started on the list straight away. It said, and there's dear Aunt Amelia there, with the list. I wonder what's on the list. I don't know. What do you think's on the list, Maxwell? Hmm. What I do you think, think's on there? I think there might be um, one scoop of ice cream and, and, uh, and no toys. Well, I don't know. We'd better read and find out. Please tell the children to be careful if you go to the park. Don't let them go near the edge of the pond or get themselves too dirty. Well, I don't think she's following the list very well because the children look like they're getting very dirty to me. But you know what? It is fun to play in the mud sometimes, isn't it? And sometimes when you're playing, you do get dirty, but that's all right. As long as you're having fun. They can have an ice cream, a bit like this one here, but just one each. They already have plenty of toys and don't let them pester you for sweets. Oh! the poppets there with Aunt Amelia. I think that looks like more than one scoop to me. Looks like ten scoops. Imagine if I had ten scoops, Maxwell. Oh, but I think I'd have a tummy ache. And they already have plenty of toys and don't let them pester you for sweets. Yes, well, look at that. And they're buying lots of sweets there and lots of toys. Like, yes. a we, like we did at Toy World. Yes, dear. I think Stinky's trying to eat the ice cream. Oh, Stinky, yes. He's quite naughty. He's had too many sweets. Oh. He's playing up. The children will need some quiet time so they don't get overexcited. Like Stinky and Maxwell, my little poppets, I think they're a bit overexcited. Although it's a special day, so I suppose we can make an allowance for that. Look at that merry-go-round there. That does look like fun. I must go on the merry-go-round again sometime, Maxwell. Do you think we should? Yes, I think we should. Stinky, stop that. I can't turn the page. Make sure that they help you with keeping the house clean and tidy and neat. Oh, well, they've made a dreadful mess there. Look at that. There's paint all over the floor. A dreadful, dreadful mess. But I have to say, my little poppets, they do look as though they're having a marvellous time. Oh, yes, I think this Aunt Amelia reminds me of an aunt that I have. I yes. Nanny McPhee? Oh, yes, Nanny McPhee. I must pay her a visit again sometime. For dinner, they can choose what to have, as long as it is something sensible. Well, look at that, my little poppets. Do you think that's a sensible meal? There's ice cream and cake and candy and all sorts of things there. Would you like to have that for dinner, Maxwell? Look at that. There's jelly there. All sorts of yummy things pizza. to eat. Pizza. I don't like pizza. Pizza. Oh, I love pizza. I like fish and chips. Oh, fish and chips. Yes, that's good. Especially if you buy the sea. It's nice to have on the beach fish and chips. They are allowed one story before bedtime, but absolutely no television. And don't let them stay up too late. And there they are there. Well, they look like they're staying up awfully late to me. And the TV is on. The telly's on. What a fun aunt yeah. this Aunt Amelia is. I think she's the opposite of... Yes, her. well, I just think she's a very fun auntie. And she likes to have fun with the poppets. The next day, Mum and Dad were coming home. So we got the house ready for them. And there they are, my little poppets, 
working away making the house nice and tidy. I think they'd have to after that mess. Yes, dear. Was that you or was that Stinky? Oh, it's Stinky. He's playing tricks again. Oh, yes, he's, he needs some time out, I think. Settle down, Stinky. I hope they've been good, asked Mum. Good as gold, said Aunt Amelia. Were the instructions helpful, asked Dad. Very, said Aunt Amelia. Mum and Dad asked if we would like Aunt Amelia to come and look after us again sometime. What do you think the Poppets would like Aunt Amelia to come back? I think that they would. I think very I'd much like to have I her would like come back. I would like her to would come you? every day. Every day, every day is a party. Yes, please, we said, and perhaps you could write another list. Oh, there's Mum and Dad there that had no idea what's been going on. I Look bet that. it's gonna say it. I bet it's gonna say all the things that they did, but instead she's actually not gonna do it because it because she's the opposite. You really think that? Well, I guess we we'll just have to wait and see, won't we? Because the end, and that was called Aunt Amelia, and I think a very appropriate book for today. Yes, well, did you enjoy that, Maxwell? Got your birthday present, huh? Oh, my lollipop, yes. Well, I don't know whether I fancy that. It's got some of Stinky's fur stuck to the side there. Well, my little poppets, we have come to the end of story time once again. And I can only say to you again and again and again, thank you so much for tuning in to story time. And you must remember, my little poppets, to subscribe if you want to see two new videos at the end of every week. And don't forget to press the like button as well. Well, Maxwell, have you had a good time? I certainly have. I think you need a time out as well. You're very high, Oh, uh, You've had too many sweets, I think. Well, as always, thank you for tuning in. Take care and bye.